Here's another recently extinct animal that you probably didn't know existed, the Cape Verde giant skink. The Cape Verde giant skink was a type of lizard that was native to the Barlavento Islands in Cape Verde. The Cape Verde giant skink used to be very common throughout most of those islands that it was native to. However, when the Portuguese started to colonize the islands in the 1400s, uh, the population did begin to decline. It started off slowly due to things like habitat loss, like the settlers using the trees and destroying the grasslands that they lived in to build settlements, and also the introduction of things like wild cat, or not wild cats, feral cats. And occasionally, reportedly, in times of scarce food, the settlers would actually eat the skinks themselves, because they were relatively large lizards getting to be over a foot long in some cases. Surveys showed that the skinks were extinct on some of the islands that they were native to as long ago as the 1600s. However, they did survive for longer on a couple of smaller islands that weren't as heavily settled by colonizers. Additionally, they were also quite popular as exotic pets as they were very chill lizards. They just kind of like hung out, they were very tame, and it didn't really bite, didn't really run away, so they were very, very popular as pets, as well as in zoos and research centers and observatories and private collectors and all of that. They were very popular. So as what happens with many popular exotic pets, the population began to decline as more and more of them were captured from the wild, thus reducing the wild breeding population. However, by the 20th century, so the 1900s, it was kind of noticed that the population was declining and people are like, oh shit, they're going to all die. And so there were efforts to establish a captive breeding program. However, it didn't really work. They didn't really breed well in captivity. So that kind of failed, unfortunately. By 1940, it was pretty much confirmed to be extinct. However, there were a couple unverified sightings in the 80s and the 90s. However, they weren't be, um, able to be proven. The most recent alleged sighting was in 2005. However, further studies in 2006 showed that no, there probably aren't any left, and so it was officially declared to be extinct in 1996, and despite the more recent sighting, it is still considered to be fully extinct.